After a long day at the dojo, there's only one drink hearty enough and manly enough to quench this thirst, and that's Coors Banquet. What's happening, Panda Nation? Peter Von Panda here. You are probably done now with the first two seasons of Cobra Kai. For all you Karate Kid fans out there, I know I am. Can't wait to season three, but you are probably aware that Johnny's drink of choice is the banquet of beers, Coors Banquet. Bartender, Coors Banquet for me, and Shirley Temple for the lady. Now, I will tell you what, it has been years since I have had a Coors. They're made in Golden, Colorado, with mountain stream water. And to be really honest, I probably haven't seen a Coors Banquet ever in real life. So I was surprised to see that they were still around, especially because Cobra Kai was filmed, you know, at least now three, four years ago, possibly. But Coors Banquet is around and they are available in cans, but they are also available in these chubby little bottles for a chubby little guy. 12 fluid ounces. You can see they're kind of cute, exotic little bottles. I really dig them. And it's that golden Coors beer label on there. I like it. So I went ahead and picked up a box of these suckers and I thought I would try it out and share it with you. Yeah. Mmm. Smells like Coors. It smells like Stroh's. This is what it looks like. You know, so if it's good enough for a karate champion, it's good enough for this guy. Ooh, 12 ounces right there, baby. Look at that golden effervescence. You know, what's sad is I'm going to be able to enjoy this Coors Banquet, but as I understand it, Billy Zabka in Karate Kid actually has not drunk one of these because they just fill the bottle with iced tea and water, I think. So, he's missing out because I'm going to try this right now. And this may be my first Coors in, I don't know, decades. Like I said, it smells like any light beer. Maybe just a little bit more spiciness than kind of your average Bud Light. Mmm. It's definitely pretty light. You know, it's kind of a thinner beer, but I would say it's got a little bit more punch. It's got a little bit more spice. It's a little richer, a little tastier than, say, a Bud Light, but more mellow and smooth and more mild kind of less bitter less tangy than a miller light so i kind of call it a beer in between there but i'm able to drink it just fine it's pretty good mm. oh stress just melts away the more you mm, let it wash over your tongue and down your throat oh. Dang, that's good. Hey, if you want to have a banquet in your house anytime, check out Coors Banquet, the banquet of beers. Peter Ron Panda, out.